Welcome back to another episode of The Eminence in Shadow. We finished off nuking the city, and then now there's some remnants as an artifact around, right? I think this leads to the Cult of Diabolos. Sherry, the pink hair girl, right? The new girl that I think... I'm not really completely sure about her. I have some thoughts about her dad, but she's investigating. She's researching the artifact to somehow it leads to somewhere. I'm not sure because there's a group that's also um, acting as if they are Shadow Garden, but we know they're not. It seems like they can only say Shadow Garden too, and I thought it was kind of funny at first, but I'm like, are they all just like test subjects? They've been just like worked on so they can only say stuff like that. They're brainwashed. Gamma has a new HQ, but... As usual, just more misunderstandings, more misunderstandings. And the murderer, right? There's like um, people getting murdered under the name of Shadow Garden. Sid thinks that it was Alexia because of that little... When, he, when, he, when she slashed him, it's like, oh, more misunderstanding. But that's the whole point of the story, right? And then Skell and Poe, I think, were the MVP of the episode. They're such ridiculous idiot. They're the perfect friends, though. I, I love them. I love them so much. And the funniest thing is Poe's name is actually Potato. That's insane. And Skell's name is Skeleton. The naming in this series, bravo. This is fucking fantastic. And at the very end, we give, you know, Sherry chocolate. She's doing research. The dad, there's something sketch about the dad because he's so invested into this artifact. He's pushing her. You know, you're the smartest. You can do this, girl. You can do this. And he's coughing at the same time, too. It feels like he has like a terminal illness. Maybe I'm getting baited. Maybe he really is just a really nice guy. But why is he pushing her to do this so much? I feel like he might be related to the cult of Diablos. Just a random guess, but something feels very off about him. Let's watch today's episode. It means he loves you. you yes. Love that person. What answer? When she answers him, he's gonna it's gonna be more misunderstanding. How is it gonna turn out? Oh oh, oh. Wh why are you moaning? What hey! Relax! That entire scene was so fit. Yeah? Eat another one! Fencing tournament! Tournament! I've been fucking waiting for a tournament since the moment we came to the school. Who entered Sid? Thank you, Skell. I, 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 I am so happy you entered Sid. Because Sid would never enter by himself because he's trying to be background character A. Okay, more plot about the cult of Diabolos that Sid does not give a shit about. Mm-hmm, and this all has to do with the rounds also, right? What does she think is understood? <laughs> New, that's not what he's talking about. Hmm. What's the fundamental goal? What are you talking about? He's still talking in the context of the tournament, right? But he's still thinking about the tournament. And New's like, ah, of course. <laughs> bye bye, New. <laughs> 24 what? No, he's com thinking completely different. No, no. New, you have no clue what he's thinking about. He doesn't even give a shit about the plot. Oh, God. So mysterious. So, so wise. Okay, we're going into the tournament already, though. Whoa! Big sis! It's been such a long time! We hardly get anything of Claire, other than her, like, getting mad for... Apprehending Sid in the torture chambers. Would he win? Oh, that's the girl that stopped Claire, I think, when she was going berserk. I vaguely remember her hairstyle. So she's super important. Yeah. A named character. Named character, again, like, as in not really an NPC. What? Okay, let's see how he does. But he's not trying to win. He's trying to not stand out. Therefore, you will just lose? Yes. You're gonna show an upset, though? The 48 tech... What has he done? Okay, let's see this. He can't win unless he wins accidentally. He's not trying to stand out. Oh! That's fast on both sides. TikTok. This is like fractions of a second happening. What are you gonna do, Sid? Is he's going for a swing, but I would anticipate him to lose. The oh, he backed off at the end. Huh? What? What'd you eat? Oh, the blood. Oh, God. 
gotcha. Good one. Perfection. That was that was actually background character arts secret technique. That was pretty cool. Damn. <laughs> she didn't even notice. Truly. No, that was but I want you to fucking win the tournament, man. But I guess he can't because you know, he can't spend. Oh? He's not giving up? <laughs> I won't give up for the sake of my friend. That's a lot of blood. It's not actual blood. There's still fire in his eyes. I will not disrespect such fire. <laughs> Why is he putting up more of a show though? It doesn't really benefit. It. I guess he wants to be more of a background character. But I want him to accidentally win and move on to the next round. I want him to win the fucking tournament. Oh no, what does he do this time? Okay. More blood eating thing? That tomato? Like, what is it this time? Yeah. Oh, no, he just got hit by it again. That's the same technique! It is he gonna give. Not yet! How many times? Okay. Six. That was like six times. Oh, seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Oh, that was like multiple strikes at the end there. Why is he being so persistent though? I, I get that he's trying to show off his background character techniques, but if you're trying to really be a background character, you should just exit. <laughs> I love how he turns around like that on his head. He's still got the fire in his eyes. What if she gives up? No, she wouldn't. I will give you everything now. Oh, wait! She's putting everything into it! But it won't. That's not really much of a difference to it. What? Wait! You can't interfere in a duel? <laughs> the referee thought that it was gonna fucking die. <laughs> the ref was like, oh shit, this kid's actually gonna die. No, 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 we gotta stop it now, but... <sighs> That's the end of the tournament. Battle of Spirits, you won! I, uh, again, I won. Oh? She seems to have... We won her respect plus... Hey, we lost the tournament, unfortunately, already, but... Plus one waifu. Hello. Oh, her answer, right? <laughs> She's ready to, like, confess. Who are you again? <laughs> oh my god, she, is, she doesn't even register in his mind. Oh my god. Is that for him? <laughs> yeah, the background character technique was that cool? Hmm. How are you drinking through your... She's got bands over his mouth. Anyways. What is that? Chocolates? Gift for him. <gasps> Man! I don't know how cookies would go into that little pouch, but... Oh, that's so nice of her. Sure. Definitely not the love at first sight chocolate gift, right? Hmm? Would you... Start out as friends? And then... Alright, sure. And if he accepts this, she's gonna be like, I'm in! <laughs> Oh, she's actually so precious. Her dad was there. <laughs> dad, what are you? I don't have a good feeling about the dad. He's... And you're really pushing her to do it. Jesus, dad. You have to roast your daughter like that. Oh, my daughter has no friends. Oh, she's going to eat another chocolate. Oh, God. Dude, <laughs> the way they animate her eating chocolate is nuts. Yeah, you're just platonic friends, right? Mm. Oh, what? Alexia, that's right, her. Oh. Hmm? Are you gonna eliminate Alexia? Wait, 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 wait. I do agree. Black coffee is the best way to do it. Anything exactly that, that ruins the coffee. It's actually blasphemous. The taste and the fragrance of bitter black coffee reminds me that I'm alive. I don't know where I heard that. I thought it was cool. Sherry, hello. <laughs> Wait, they got a picture like that together? And she keeps it around? I mean, it's not really facing forward, but still. That's a lot of sugar. I'm telling you, you gotta drink it black. 
this is a blasphemy, man. But hey, if you enjoy it, you enjoy it. Then again, I started drinking black coffee because I had no money to buy sweeteners in college. So because I was broke, I was forced to drink black coffee and now I'm just used to it. So yeah. Sherry is actually so precious and adorable. Look at her. Look at her hair just like flip down whenever it like reacts to her emotion. What is she he is feeling at the moment? Now it's going to perk up, right? Yeah, it was a fake relationship. She's so happy. <laughs> Is she getting jealous? Why is she shaking? It shouldn't bother you. Then again, Alexia did get rejected by Sid, so this jealousy because of relax your cup. Hmm. I didn't expect Alexia to get this upset. <laughs> Just... <laughs> She's so pissed. Is she gonna make Sid join the student council? She noticed. Hello. What are you doing? Huh? What is it gonna form? Some kind of monster? But this is our next threat. I can't... I hope uh, Sid goes I am atomic on him. In the school campus? A barrier. The fuck? Alright, we're getting right into it. But it's gonna be a cliffhanger pretty soon, right? Why are they attacking in school all of a sudden? I guess... I mean, their whole point is to spread the name of Shadow Garden by doing horrific acts, right? Oh, wait! He said something else other than we are Shadow Garden there! That's cheating! Nah, this is breaking my immersion now. He has to only say we are Shadow Garden. Like, even if we don't have magic, we still have swordsmanship. We have Oriana. I think we have some pretty strong people here. And at the worst case, we have Sid to bail everyone out. Huh. Are they more stronger in this barrier? Where they Your magic isn't going to work. Yeah, exactly. But it should be fine. You don't, you don't need to rely on magic, right? Sid? Oh, shit. With the magic, they can just break our sword. Uh -oh. Uh oh, maybe we do need the magic after all. Sid? The fuck? Why is. That wasn't very background character of you, you just saved her! If anything, she's gonna respect him even more now after this. You're gonna be fine though, right? No, it's fine. This bullet doesn't mean anything. But if he doesn't have magic, can he heal himself? Isn't that. The slime isn't working anymore. The fuck? Wait. Are we about to get isekai again? No! Wait, 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 wait. He should be fine in every other circumstance, but there's no magic. And if there's no magic, then he can't heal himself. But I, I think we're being led to believe that he needs magic to do something. No, Sid is... A master, he's mastered everything, all types of martial arts and fucking piano skills. And no, 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 he should be fine. He should be fine. But right now, I'm thinking things are looking pretty bad. Also, Alexia is conveniently outside the school right now. I'm not sure why she's not being a part of this, but then again, she does have a broken arm. I don't know what's going on. And then there's some development with Sherry that's nice. I still don't completely trust her dad. He just felt very off in the last episode of he was pushing Sherry for this research for the artifact. I don't know, but I, I I think I think Sid will be fine. He has to. He's a fucking main character. But how? He has no match. Maybe he didn't get cut. Maybe he just moved so fucking fast and he was able to, you know, show another background character technique again and we're getting baited. I hope that's the case. But hey, if you stick around this long, if you didn't enjoy my reaction, you already know what I'm going to say. Check out the other videos and plays to my channel. If you watch another video immediately after this one, it helps the YouTube algorithm push out my small channel to recommend the sort of average chance to compete with some of your favorite reactors. Until next time, guys, take care.